The risks of letting your baby sleep in a swing. Baby swings can be a great tool for keeping your little one entertained, but it's important to use them properly. While the gentle motion of the swing can often lull infants to sleep, allowing them to stay asleep in this position has been deemed risky by safe sleep experts. Although babies may look peaceful resting in a swing, there are potential hazards to be aware of. If you do choose to let your baby nap in a swing, it's crucial to supervise them at all times. Even a short nap in the swing is okay if you're in the same room and keeping an eye on your child. However, letting your baby sleep all night in a swing can be dangerous, especially for infants under 4 months old. Their neck muscles are weak and they can slump over, which could lead to suffocation. It's important to remember that baby swings are not designed as sleep environments. Safe sleep guidelines recommend that babies be placed on their back on a firm, flat surface for sleep. It's also crucial to ensure that your baby's airway is clear and unobstructed while they sleep. While baby swings can be a convenient way to soothe your baby, it's important to prioritize safety above all else. Always follow the manufacturer's instructions and recommendations for safe use, and never leave your baby unsupervised in a swing. By taking these precautions, you can help ensure that your little one stays safe and comfortable while using a baby swing. In addition to being potentially dangerous, using a swing as a sleep environment for extended periods of time can also lead to developmental delays. Infants need a lot of time on their tummy to develop their core muscles, and spending too much time in a swing can limit their opportunities to do so. It's important to provide your baby with plenty of supervised tummy time on a safe, flat surface to help them develop properly. It's also important to make sure that the swing you choose is appropriate for your baby's age and size. Always read the manufacturer's recommendations and warnings before using a swing, and follow the weight limits and age restrictions specified in the instructions. Using a swing that is too small or too large for your baby can increase the risk of injury or suffocation. When using a swing, it's important to remember that it is not a substitute for human interaction and attention. While swings can be a useful tool for soothing your baby, it's important to spend plenty of time holding, cuddling, and playing with your little one to help them develop social and emotional skills.